After the oil sample removed, I noticed that the oil pickup tubes was very loose from the oil pump inlet. So you can see from this photo, the O-ring at the end of the pickup tube was nearly at the edge of the oil pump inlet. So this may have caused my engine cold start of vibrations and the noises until the oil pickup tube was sucked a little bit into the oil pump inlet. From this photo, you can see that the oil pickup strainer is situated below the oil pump and the balancer assembly, close to the rear of the engine. There are two bowls for holding the oil pickup strainer onto the oil pump and the balancer assembly. From this photo, you can see one leg of the oil pickup strainer for the fixing bolt was broken off from the strainer. Why did we have a loose oil pickup tube and a broken strainer fixing leg? We found a possible course. Dented oil sump. After I put the sealant onto the oil sump and tried to install the sump onto the engine, I found I couldn't without forcing the oil pickup tube away from the oil pump inlet. Why? The dented part of the oil sump did not leave enough space for the oil pickup strainer to stay in its properly installed position. This photo shows clearly the dented oil sump. Somebody may have jacked the car from the oil sump. I managed to knock the dent out and install it properly. This is the happy story. The terrible, noisy, cold engine start problem has disappeared after all the works around the oil pickup strainer and oil sump.